Palmer man voicing his concerns over a culvert built directly under a mass pike overpass in the town. Well, he says a drainage problem through the culvert could open up a sinkhole underneath the overpass if something isn't done in time. And he spoke exclusively to Western Mass News reporter Audrey Russo, who's digging deeper on the issue. All of this debris is stuff that you've cleared out yes. of the drain. All this is from me. This Palmer resident tells Western Mass News he's been clearing this lake drain on Shearer Street once a month, minus the winter. This in particular drained three years. He doesn't want to be identified by name, but rather his YouTube channel Post 10. He says making nature videos is his hobby, but this particular culvert on Shearer Street is starting to concern him. I've been doing it to stop the road from flooding. This thing here is something new I discovered in the past few months. He said he became really concerned when he saw clear water entering through one channel and dirty, muddy water coming out the other side, right underneath an I-90 overpass. The corrugated pipe in the ground is falling apart. It has holes rusted through it. So soil from beneath the highway is able to get washed out, and I'm concerned it's causing a sinkhole of some type. Western Mass News looked at who owns the culvert and found it's the Mass DOT. But the lake itself appears to be owned by a private LLC, according to Palmer's assessor website. We attempted to contact them, but couldn't find a working number. We reached out to the Mass DOT in the morning for a statement, and hours later when our cameras arrived at the culvert, we found their crews around the pipe. I would suggest that a full culvert assessment is done. We showed footage of the culvert to a civil engineer at Foss and O'Neill in Springfield. Eric Bernardin says it's common for that type of culvert to show wear and tear after a few decades. Rusting and then breakdown of the pipe does happen. Today we use a lot more high density polyethylene, a black plastic, or or reinforced concrete are the two most common materials that last significantly longer. But Bernardin says a gargantuan sinkhole appearing overnight is not likely. It will be a smaller hole and it won't like go from a small hole to a very large hole that would swallow a car, you know, in a matter of minutes or days. It'll take longer than that. He also cautions people against taking matters into their own hands when it comes to clearing drains by themselves. They are considered confined space and you should be adequately trained. Post 10 says he's trying to make waves because he's seeing something and wants to say something before someone gets hurt. If I just left us there and that road collapses, like, I'm just saying it's dangerous. And Would you feel guilty if you knew that this is That was Audrey Rousseau reporting. Western Mass News is still waiting for a reply from the Mass DOT.